Well, here we are. Um, this is going to be the scene of Soundwave, and it's the uh, water tank at Plymouth University Marine Institute. There's Sam Freeman, who's doing the programming, and this is me, the composer. It's absolutely the scale of this is much larger than I. Well, I think I did imagine it, but it's still, still huge. Um, I don't know if you can get a sense if I turn it at myself. And, um, this is this is the deepest part here. Those are the, the large wave paddles. Um, there's somebody you can get a sense of the size. You look at that person. Then look at the wave paddles. There's the deep part. That's the gantry that I'll be standing on. It's movable, so I'll be more central, and I'll be using the um, the uh, control suit to control those paddles and generate waves that will be uh, picked up by the height um, be picked up by the wave height measurements and turned into sound by sound software we'll also have in the coastal tank here, the mini tank, we'll have some water drummers based on the Baka African water drummers um, accompanying and being involved and here's the guy who has to make it all work <laughs> You don't look at all nervous. Uh, and I'm the guy to blame if it all goes wrong. Do I look nervous? No. Oh, well, let's, uh, let's pick on Deborah for a minute. And this is the person the university will blame if it all goes wrong. <laughs> no, no, they'll blame me. So there you go. It's really it's so inspiring being here. Just this huge concrete structure um, that we're going to have total control of. It's really uh, very exciting. Yeah. Well, that's. I mean, we've been talking about uh, the gestures already that I can use. Uh, you know, and it's going to be. Um, we've talked about some of the different types of ways that we could, or you could use within it. Um, I mean, I could imagine. Uh, you know, I could imagine if I'm on the gantry, say, and you know, if I gesture with my left hand in a certain direction, it makes the left paddles do something, you know, and something like that, it could cause, it could be very interesting. The other thing we're talking about is how to, how to measure the waves, where to put the wave gauges, and how do you feel about, um, I mean, what we're thinking is putting a long piece of lighting gantry right. across to suspend the wave gauges off, that's what we'll do in experiments probably. Okay. So that might spoil things easily, so the other option is to have sort of underwater tripods and stick them up through the surface of the water from and below. Will the wave, can the wave gauges be done in a, like a, a spatial two-dimensional pattern? Whatever pattern you want, as 